Hello everybody and welcome to episode two of Ebrius SMP. I really hope you enjoyed that time lapse. I had a lot of fun making it uh, and it was really cool digging out the places and editing it and all that. It was really fun. Uh, I built this in between episodes. It is a villager breeder with four villagers currently. Uh, I have to manually feed them, but that is perfectly fine. I'm just harvesting those carrots and potatoes with my fortune pickaxe, which actually yields more. Uh, and I got two villagers currently. I had t a total of three and then two bred up already, brought them back up there, so that's full now. And then I will breed up, I think probably like 20 to 30 villagers, so I have enough for the iron farm that I want to build. Uh, which is also going to be probably temporary here, I don't know, we'll see. Uh, but let's go work on the skeleton spawner and the cave spider spawner actually. Uh, so yeah, I'll meet you there in a sec. And here we are. Oh, something is unlit here. Uh, give me torches. There we go. This is the skeleton spawner and I have a, I think I did a 13 by 13 room so I can have one block on the wall. And then over here, I have a pretty big room and it's, uh, I believe it's symmetrical. It's not lined up with that one because I don't want to dig more here. But basically what I want to do here now is place rails underneath so we can have minecart hoppers going and magma locks above. So I'll get to that and I'll be back once I'm ready to do more. Okay, so for the spiders, uh, I have this going now. Uh, it's a full floor of magma blocks. They drop down and they're slightly loud as well. Let's turn that down a bit. Uh, so they drop down directly on the magma blocks, die in a couple of game ticks and string gets, gets picked up by a minecart that then delivers it over here and this is a, the simplest drop-off station that i know it's a comparator that detects when items are in the hopper it turns off the torch turns off the repeater which turns off the rail so the minecart stays here uh and then the minecart just goes all the way there and it's basically that same pattern that you can see there it's just back and forth with rails all the way to the end and that is all gucci and good and the, the the thing is, we're not going to have that spawner and this two spawners active at the same time anyway, unless I do like a minecart track that leads me around and around the spawners, well, which I'll see if I'll do, I don't know. This is probably, I'm not going to be using this for too long anyway. Uh, what I might, I'm probably going to do is have the skeletons. I will have them go drop down here. I bl I'll flush them. I'll see if I flush them this way and then go up and then over and then down here somewhere next to this. Because I'm going to have to figure out how far away I can be. I think some somewhere over here is the farthest away I can be for the spawner to be active. So I might then flush them over in this corner and then go up top there and then over the spawner. And then drop them down here so I can be closer and the, the minecart can bring items over here. That's not a problem and then have some sort of storage area or something something and have a nice viewing area for the spawner. But I will work with for, on that in between episodes because I don't have enough time today to get on with anything else here because I need to decorate the walls and all that. So I'll do that uh, in between. And yeah, we're getting string. We're doing good. Uh, one thing that I did do in between uh, cuts here, I went to... Uh, I went to a, uh, this guy's, uh, John Barini, is he online? He, he left. Uh, I went to his place and used his j just cave spider grinder and skeleton grinder to repair my tools. And I got a cave spider head, which I have up, up above. Um, and it's really cool. So yeah, with that said, uh, I want to thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, drop me a like button. Drop me a like button. That is not how it works. Hit that like button. And also consider subscribing if you want to see more. And I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.